Hi guys, Sebastian here from 28 year old Apple Virgin. Today I'm going to be showing you a video that teaches you how to make web clips in Safari and OS X Leopard. Web clips are basically snippets of web pages that you can use as live dashboard widgets. Um, these are the widgets here, you hit F12 to find those. And um, I've got one for my TV guide, uh, my broadband usage meter, weather, an iTunes widget which shows the lyrics to the currently playing song, um, a PHP one, and a system monitor here which shows me all sorts of things about my system. Now if I want to make a web clip, I need to go into Safari. Now this is my um, Twitter blog, so I suggest everyone um, signs up to Twitter and follows me on that as well, but I'll show you how to make a a web clip of my um, most recent Twitter blog. You hit this scissor tool and then you can choose whichever portion of the page you want to make your widget for. I'm going to choose this one but then resize it so it's only showing the first the, the most recent entry. And that's just about it there. Now all I need to do now is click add and bang there's my Twitter clip uh, there's my there's my web clip there it's loading it now and I can flip it around and put put all sorts of nice borders on it there's that one or if you were, were using a photo I'd suggest you use that one you can use um, all sorts of things up I'm just going to go with I'll go with this one. Now, um, as you can see, it's grabbed a bit of the bottom there, which I'm not entirely happy with. So, what I'll do, I'll edit it. And you can edit it right in here. There we go. Perfect. Now, the beauty of this is if I go to my Twitter log now and make another entry, this widget will update automatically. So let's do that now. I'll bring up my other Firefox window. If I can, Twitter. Okay, so recording web clip. demo video so I'll post that to my Twitter blog that's done now theoretically when I go into my dashboard widgets it will take a couple of seconds but then update automatically so let's keep an eye on this one ah, there we go so it takes a few seconds to update but you know it's pretty good there's all sorts of different applications you could use this for. I mean, um, I had one for photo of the day for for National Geographic. Um, I had the Daily Dilbert. I even had a um, a weather satellite photo, so I could get a live a live satellite photo uh, of the current weather conditions every time I hit F12. So there's heaps you could do with this. You could um, use it for watching eBay item prices and anything like that it's really cool anything on the web you want to keep an eye on just make a web clip anyway guys that's about it um, next entry I do I'll show you how to use the uh, Google widgets within the um, within leopard uh, just in, in a couple of weeks ago Google has made it possible to use their own widgets within your leopard widgets so keep an eye out for that one okay guys bye